My name is Daisy and I've been attending Neighborhood Ministries since I was 11 years old, so about fifth grade. The way I found out about Neighborhood Ministries was a friend that lived down the street from me and she said, do you want to go to church? I said, sure. And um, ever since she brought me here, I, I stayed. <laughs> One of the best memories I've had was definitely going to camp. Um, growing up in a family that just stayed at home, a single mom, uh, we didn't have that availability to go out and travel or do things. So when I went to camp for the first time in my life, that was something big, something huge. It was my first time getting out of Glendale and um, going into a cabin with other kids. Uh, that was new for me. My leader at that time was Nadine. And it was easy to identify with Nadine because I could tell Nadine had grew up in the neighborhood but I could tell that there was a change in her. So when I seen her automatically, I was able to relay and, and connect. And just when I went into worship, that was my first time experiencing people singing out loud and kids being happy. So um, I thought it was weird at first. I was like, what is this? You know, you know, at 11 years old, you know, but seeing her just clap and singing and putting her arms on us and hugging us, um, that right there was one of the best memories because it definitely got me connected. And that's when I began to open up and not embarrassed to sing and seeing that this is normal, this is good, um, especially coming from a neighborhood where it was infested with gangs, drugs, um, you know, toughness, roughness, and um, if you were to sing, it was almost like you got laughed at. During high school, um, I was a junior and I became pregnant. So being a teen mom at that moment, um, that was really difficult. I know that I was gonna be the first one out of my family to graduate high school, and that was the goal. Um, so being pregnant was almost like a pullback. Uh, Neighborhood Ministries had a program for teen moms. So when uh, Google's, Google's told me about it, uh, she would come pick me up and um, she would take me to Neighborhood Ministries and we would learn about parenting classes, a little bit of um, breastfeeding, uh, emotional um, stability. Um, we would get points uh, to when we attended to buy diapers. And um, at this time, the person that, um, that I became pregnant from, as soon as I told him I was pregnant, two days later, he went to prison. So I was already in a state of panic. I wasn't sure how I was gonna do it. And, um, but with Neighborhood Ministries and, and Google's picking me up, that made uh, a big difference in my life. It gave me a lot of hope on that I can be a teen mom and get through it and still finish my school and uh, there's still um, possibilities of me getting out of this circle of depression. Getting all the help that I got from them makes me want to help the youth also because if it changed my life, I could change their life. And all it takes is, again, being a leader, like how I had my leader, that was, that was big for me. Some of these kids could relate and look at me and say, hey, she, she's helping me and give that hope back. Mm -hmm.